Welcome back to Let's Play Tales of Vesperia. I don't remember how I was doing edition. How do I get? I'm back. There we go. Hey there. Here's Tailbur's Burrier. And here's a dragon, okay. Yeah. Turles or uh, Burst Burrier. Okay, so. Yeah, gee, up, I think you, you missed a bit last time. A bit, yeah. yeah. Oh. I wasn't here either, so. Oh, yes, you neither. There was a bunch of stupid dungeons, but the main thing is there's like a jellyfish in the sky now, and you gotta go talk to it. Also, we got the airship. That's not a jellyfish, that's a. That's a. Strong it's not a jellyfish. <laughs> that's a space station. Yeah. It's definitely a jellyfish. Okay, well, let's That's go no say... Moon. I, so I, I assume that we would get a airship at some point, so... Yeah. Yes, that occurred. And as I was saying last time, you can now do the achievement for going 10,000 kilometers. Yeah. Wait, crit... Oh, this wait, so we're all in... the, uh, elf... Oh, okay, so we're in... Oh, my Orzo! In home <laughs> this is amazing. Yeah, that's acting up again. Well, dude, is that the eye of the, the whale thing? Yeah. What is the whale thing? That's ba the, that's the dragon that Judith Bayou used to ride. Or... Wait, really? Yep. Yeah. He evolved. Did you watch the videos? No. <laughs> Tales of Vesporka. Well, I'm trying to suspend my disbelief here. Okay. Mm. That uh, so Baul <laughs> evolved at probably level 47. Who would have thought that the Critian the city would have Critians in it? Also, they were they an identical. Well, it's you know. racist. They they all speak uh, <laughs> Esperanto. <laughs> These visitors really are from the outside. <laughs> Just pick Carol up and throw him off the edge. <laughs> Not that Not one. Believer. Visitors are actually from somewhere else. Madness. Yeah. How strange. What curious ornaments you wear. Well, maybe they came over from the other part of the jellyfish. Stare, you know. How many parts? Maybe it is polite to stare in their society, Rita. Didn't you ever think about that? You don't know much about their culture. Also, they weren't talking about anybody else's clothes here. Clothing, except for Rita's is this monster an perhaps? I like the guy in the back right behind Rita who's just smiling a little bit. Have you forgotten turns you? and walks away. Yeah, yeah I souped up his engine. Oh, you got the one suspension. who suspension. Bowles all like, what's up? Right? Hey. And Rita's How's it going, bro? <laughs> she drank way too many surge. <laughs> I believe Judith. Too many Red Bulls. Yes, Judith was your name. There was something you had to attend to. Dude, look at that sword. Yeah, that sword's crazy. It's also done. We need a new one for dogs. We would like to meet with the elder. I love dogs' outfit, by the way. Please feel free to do as you wish. <laughs> I like how the how the Yuri doll just sort of like sits at a forty-five degree angle. We got yeah. one of those too. One hundred cups of coffee. <laughs> <laughs> this is the part where she's about to break out and save everyone from a burning building. Okay, so they're a bit weird. Yuri, right. what are you carrying? Oh my God. Yeah, it's that axe is It's ridiculous. got a tennis racket. It's, <laughs> it's a tennis racket that really hurts. Oh, you missed. Yes. pretty much like that. <laughs> like what? Oh, easy going, unafraid. We are Uncaring. dreamers and optimists, for better or worse. Are they all psychopaths like you, Judy? They're all passive aggressive. So like yeah. How should I put it? Tell you your He's your beehive hair looks pretty nice. They're not really thinking that. Sounds <laughs> like quite a unique individual. I think it's nice kind of refreshing here. that Judy's like self-aware of. This you know, should be interesting. <laughs> in the situation in the party. Mm. Meet the Krugs. The Krugs are different than I imagined. Oh, I saw about three minutes totally of that agree. when we were doing the rock flex. Like, so nope. different. You know, more like. I thought they'd be more like you, Judith. Yeah, yeah. I'm seeing far less skin. I thought they'd all be like you. I mean, Shut the fuck up. Raven goes right so for the main. <laughs> he has on his mind. To? What are you looking at me for? I was talking about her personality. Her Seriously, gigantic personality. <laughs> Huge <laughs> tracks of land. Amen. <laughs> uh, Carol would be the kind of person man. who would insist he's all about the personality. Yeah. There you go. Uh, there's your tennis racket. That looks kind of lopsided. I, I, I stalk Nan for her personality. Mm. Okay, so this is inside the jellyfish, I, I guess? guess? Yes, yeah. you flew into the jellyfish. Where there's that a city. in like an apple screensaver. We really don't like have anybody cleaning up around here. Nah. No. Well, doesn't really matter too much. I mean, really. Who's gonna come by and be mad about it? <laughs> That's true. 
They never cleaned up the place because they never expect any visitors. Yeah, exactly. From the outside. That's so yeah, basically cool. last time we beat up <laughs> Carol's girlfriend. Um, we did? Then Baul evolved. Okay. Then... We, pro we, we went looking for... Quests. Yeah, we, we, we did a bunch of side quests and is. went looking for a bunch of stuff. Baul was their little dragon friend that used so to be smaller, whale, but now it's a giant whale. Dragon Evolved. Judy's remember dragon how, friend. Yeah, remember how Rita's oh. all like, the dragon rider is like, destroying Plastia, blah, 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 blah. That's a Pokemon. Mm-hmm. And then the game literally called it evolving. <laughs> oh, God. Because it was the... Remind Whoa, me. look at this dude's fucking collar. <laughs> Sorry, that just reminded me of uh, the best workout shirt ever, which mm. is... Uh, Working my puff into tough. Yep, I've seen that one. Puff into tough. <laughs> it's great. Elder be popping all the collars. What's up, bro? I thought like these elves didn't age, or maybe he's just really old. It's always yeah, the elves racist. age slower than he than humans. So he's like a couple thousand years old. Right? Probably something like that. I thought that the Earth Lower stopped using Blastia. Well, don't you watch? You know, fucking Fox News up here or something? Come on. Christian Fox Alert! News. Like, Bodhi Blastia on the rise! <laughs> no, because see, Bodhi Blastia contributing to global warming, so of course they're not going to report on it, Pat. Okay. Come on. Mm. Global warming? Then why is it nice and cold up here in the atmosphere? <laughs> so, wait, hold on. Is this like, the cores of the Bodhi Blastia are made from the crushed apatheas, which themselves are like condensed. And to monster things. monster yeah. things, yes. And then you just so snort them cares. and just go crazy. I thought recycling <laughs> was a good thing. So they're like, so really what they're saying is they want to hunt whales for scientific reasons. Pretty much. They're the Japanese. <laughs> a bit ironic, huh? Gotta be able to, to uh, comment on your own culture. Maybe. Although there are, I guess it is a, an apt analogy because Japanese people really want to. Mm. Trying to find out what sort of role blasts you played in ancient times. Well, they were used as weapons. We already know that. Mm -hmm. Folklore. Are we gonna have to read some books. I don't want any we would never read books. No one in the party all, can actually read. You gotta track down all the Chozo lore. <laughs> Scan everything. <laughs> all of Rita's books are just like, like graphic novels. Yeah. <laughs> That's how she gets through them so quickly. She reads the graphic novels that have a lot of writing, and she can justify it by saying, "Well, there's a lot of text, so I'm basically reading a book." <laughs> I read her article the other day about how some law MBAs or something are like. Uh, using graphic novels for case studies now. It's, I don't know. <laughs> that sounds amazing. Why did their houses look like Fabergé eggs? Because classy? Yeah, this whole place just uses yeah. class, don't you think? Yeah, that's why there's just broken stuff in the street. Well, those that's are just their blastias classy. that they discarded long ago. And that's, then that's never that's bothered to clean up. You can't even kill time coming to a place like this. <laughs> it's feng shui rubber. So, it's there, it's coming there with this a purpose. Place, Coming to this place literally has no purpose. How boring, you're so yeah. normal. They just want to, you know, sit around, eat dinner in Dude. their Fabergé eggs inside their jellyfish thing. I'm sorry, Kuvo, but your party's just too oh, mainstream. I was apparently. wondering where, when he was going to show up. I was about to say something. I was hoping he'd be like a giant hard-boiled egg or something. <laughs> no, this is better. I like this, though. I could go for the soft serve right now. Did he just throw something at the kid? <laughs> he always takes off his glasses and chucks them or something. If he had glasses. Cream stew. Great. Yeah, let me let me show you my You're skilled out of the wall there. Yeah. Arr, 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 arr. No, he's he's digging into it, you know, to get the to get the ingredients. That's where he stashed him. Mm-hmm. Okay, well. I'm just gonna kind of walk around here. They haven't heard from Wonder Reporter either. 
I don't know also, if you ever see very, him again. She has a lack of hard hat. Yeah. Well, that's a problem with uh, modern reporters and journalism. They just they don't go out in the field do their work. They just go to Twitter and Facebook and start <laughs> quoting things off there. And that, that's what Wanda Reporter's doing. It's watching Twitter feeds. It's yeah, it's because she's it's like a, an out of out of network guild, guild member. Doesn't even have so, any casual. So we have this information on Man. We actually lifted it from her Facebook page. So here's here are a few pictures here. This seems pretty good. The perfect armor. So that means you don't have to buy anything. You'll never else, have right? to buy it ever again. And it's such a steal. It's that cheap. That's a fancy cloak. Oh shit! Dog is pinching. Yep. Just gonna buy things for everyone real quick. Cause... Might as well. Yeah. Really wish it would change the character model too. Yeah. The one downfall of Tales. We games. need more costumes. We don't have any costumes yet. Well, that's not my problem. Yes, it is. You gotta accessorize, brother. Because I know for a fact that we are missing some amazing costumes for Carol. So. Well, I don't know. Carol's glasses are pretty nice. Well, you can use the accessories with the costumes, right? Oh. Yes. So, hmm. yeah. Because the costumes ones. just come from titles. It's not affected by the accessory slot. Although there is one costume for Carol that I saw that might not actually be compatible with the glasses, just because <laughs> the way it is. I'm not sure. You never Queen know Iver. until you try. Queen's Whip. I think she needs a new spear. I'm trying to remember if they did this all before. I don't know. I mean, if it says That's zero, dope. then you could just buy it, because she doesn't have any of those things, of those uh, attacks. So while we're going through menus, Ryan's drinking uh, whiskey, and I started off with this uh, Golden Drock 9000 Quad. Ooh. It's very tasty. Sounds yeah. it. She, uh, she's still doing XP. And it was only XP like share? No, so we or something for the bottle, which is like half the price. <laughs> Sorry, if I knew there was menus, I would have done this ahead of time, but our, N -O -P -E. our uh, gear is kind of shitty, so... Yeah. <laughs> That's kind of what it always comes down to. Okay, we're good. Let's go inside here. Or I think it's the red house is where the next, pet. like, actual plot if, thing is. I wonder if Repeat has a mouth cancer. Nah. Like periodontal disease or something? Nah. He's he's just immune to that. Little does everyone know, but his pipe is actually an e-pipe. <laughs> he's had this technology for years. I don't think he'd do e-pipe, man. He's a, he has all the sick shit. <laughs> he doesn't even have an eye. You know he's into the hardcore stuff. He sold his eye for me. <laughs> <laughs> I am the warehouse keeper. Oh, oh, you we found it. <laughs> Well, can't is that a thing that's important? It's a recurring side quest of sorts. Oh, fucking! It's me. Uh, but uh, you can you just Karen, go up to the red house. High school. It's me. Eight years ago. Your good buddy. <laughs> yep. Me, me, me. Dog sleeping under the table. Dog don't care. Do you think we should really just go in? That room. He's the one who told us to wait for him here. I guess the Critians really are different. They don't. They don't seem to be in any great rush things. to get things don't done. Be that's be for sure. sure. I know they certainly are weird, aren't they? Actually, you're kind of like that too, Judith. That's funny. So I don't different. see that at all. Psychopaths always say ah, that. There you are. <laughs> Does he have a bone in his hair? Like, did they wrap his hair around the bone? Hell yeah, they did. <laughs> or secretly, they're just horns, Welcome and his back. hair goes around the horns. <laughs> Going to put I've it past his waist. Now, you never know. This, way, if you will. this guy doesn't have a name, does he? The human horn. He's no, he doesn't. He's just the this elder. This is the very means by which the lore of Miorzo Please, is refer to my down. PowerPoint presentation. <laughs> but, uh, I like how little Yuri just is just wall. on his side now. Judith, use the Nagig as you touch the wall Nagig. and repeat these words. City of dreams, the Muad'Dib. mist, reality's <laughs> extension. Muad do you really need to say the passphrase in order to turn on the projector? Obviously. City well, you know of dreams failed and missed. Mm. Reality's extension? We probably don't even have, like, last pass. 
Looks like a pretty that secure some, password, though. That is some cinemascope shit right there. <laughs> I'm surprised they get the projector working so well. I mean, whenever Welcome I use, whenever, whenever, whenever I used it at work, it's like it's always this huge struggle because it never works. You have to call IT and then play around the cables. You're, You're the person that Ryan hates. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. These murals appear only when this power. You heard of these new uh, TVs that are coming out that are actually ultra widescreen and like curved this backs and stuff. This painting is kind yep. of creepy. Yeah. The Critia. Pretty pretty. Of, wisdom. of course, the Critians have had it for a while. They just oh, didn't want to share it with the world. It, it's just like Japan. Japan has all the technology. They had like 4G and shit way before we did. They're hoarding it. The bastards. Yeah. <laughs> pretty much. Is that like Kalufu right there? Is like tentacles of strange shit? More or less. Kalu Kalua, the, uh, the drunk <laughs> Kalua. god of the <laughs> Makes awesome mix <laughs> He just likes right. making white Russians They're and giving them people the dark god of awesome mixed drinks. <laughs> no, the dark okay. god. The dark god would be the uh, Colorado bulldog equivalent, I guess. <laughs> Actually, you still it use Kahlua in like that. It's just uh, coffee beans you use instead. The oh. air is trying to eat the planet. I thought the planet created air. Devour. It's it's a bit of an Chaos abusive relationship. It's like a snake eating its own tail. No, that's just the plot to this. The oh, okay. Grew ever stronger and brought forth a cataclysm. In our terror, we gave a name to the cataclysm. The Autopolis. So air is basically Pac-Man when in high enough quantities. I'm never gonna be able to say that word. Well, at least we aren't ghosts. There you go. Then we're more cool. I was gonna say the archipelagos. The archipelagos. Archipelagos. Singing ghosts. Okay, so... <laughs> God damn it. The world created air, and there's a lot of it, and it mm -hmm. became this monster thing, decided mm -hmm. it wanted to kill the world. Mm -hmm. So the Entelikea decided that, hey, maybe we should stop this? Mm -hmm. hey, could that be you're, you're keeping up. This is the dumbest... <laughs> humans fighting something off. No. Oh, this, well, this seriously sounds like a DM just like was pulling it out of his ass as like the session kept going on. <laughs> Still better than Symphonia. This game is more of a character study than a uh, grand sleeping story. Is evidence enough of that? So then, is this painting showing the Autophagos being brought under See, it control? It rolls off that dude's tongue so easily. Hey, what's the yeah. last thing it says there? It says Gary was here, ashes a loser. Just P2. Autophagos. Smell you later. Hearing the world's prayers, life faded from the child of the full moon. The artifacts <laughs> disappeared into the void. So look, see? It seems like Estelle needs to die anyway, as Judy pulls her spear out. <laughs> what? No, no hard feelings. The world's prayers. Life faded from the children of the full moon. I really hope this game turns into an air. Our moment. world was preserved. <laughs> But the story shall remain here for generations. Oh, the moon I hope you don't. I hope you don't need your healer that much. Uh, also, we got uh, Raven. <laughs> Hold up. Exactly. I'm still, I'm still confused at whether the official translation is Eris or Eris. Oh, mean? shut up, Pat. <laughs> God damn it. Who cares? <laughs> Look, man, Sephiroth ruined my childhood. Why do you no, have the hot for? No, I, I didn't even play that. <laughs> but that's seven past like two hours. Which led to the downfall of their entire it gets civilization. Good. They then chose to abandon the Blastia. Okay, now, the so they realized that using Blastia Earth. makes more Sign air come, so they stopped doing it because they want the Earth not to be killed by that archipelago thing. Yeah, their ruling party is basically yeah. Greenpeace. Okay, well, this is go. seriously like this the global warming. This is all the lore of Miorzo. Thanks. Here. Yeah, they're pretty heavy-handed about their analogies you know in the most recent helpful? game, in the more recent There's game. This magic a magic cucumber? Yup. Are we gonna feed it to a kappa? Ryan, when are we gonna play Going Mon's Great Adventure? Never. I keep feel bugging we may me about need to it. impose on you until our friend has calmed down. So good. Magic cucumber. That's a you plot device I didn't, I didn't see door. coming. No well, what right did now. you think the final one? You're afraid to use the house next door. No one lives there right now. Our housing market is kind of in shambles. Sorry. <laughs> Thank you. you know, they overbuilt a few okay, years back. I would say it's underwater, but we're really high up in the sky. <laughs> what if, what so... if you don't like the taste they of are in a the bubble. cucumber? They are in a bubble. Then a magic cucumber won't help. All right, we're out. We out. The legend of the Everything the Elder said is true, isn't it? 
His interpretation yeah, let's just agree with everything perfect, he said. But with all he told us, it was very convincing. We knew this was a global problem once we talked to Pharaoh. He granted us time to know how we would react but the world to this. Flat. You have to regenerate the earth. Cut out to handle the situation. No, please no. <laughs> world man regeneration. So everything's just going according to Pharaoh's plan. Which one of you wants to be the angel? I don't think it's going according to Pharaoh's plan. I just think Pharaoh actually has the foresight to understand what's happening. So Rita just is like passive aggressive towards Estelle or something. Yeah. She's Sundari for Estelle. Well, she does, like, she's the only friend that Rita ever had, so... She's kind of upset that she's probably gonna die. Except this is a Tales game, so she's not, but... Don't spoil it. <laughs> you think they would really kill one of the main characters in a Tales game? I do. It's sure to happen. Yeah, okay, so... Am I supposed to go to... He's in next door, right? So this white building up here? Yeah, the other building that's up top there. Oh. Can't. You have to take a separate staircase to get there. Yeah. Oh, oh no, actually, I think it's the room with the save point. Now that I think yeah, about it. Yeah. This blue one here. Yeah. Then what's the other building? Is that it's like the just conference the background room? building? Yeah. It's there to make the Cataclysm? place look a little less empty. If that legend's true, then maybe the power of the child of the full moon is the only to keep thing to blame for bringing up I think the Autophagos. Just, uh, dumped off. Dogs in frame. Dog is in frame. That's classy. That? That's the world's prayers, damn. From the children wow. Of the full moon part. There is nothing the unintentional the about that. <laughs> the of the full moon. Okay, so if the air congregates into this crazy monster, mm -hmm. and, re and Estelle, as the child of the full moon, can get rid of air in large quantities, how is this a problem? Well, clearly they tried to do that, but then that didn't work out, so she just killed herself, and uh, it worked out. Well, she but, didn't kill herself. Yeah. So really, the other child to, of the like, full moon. Yeah, she's not like she's the first cycle. one. Yeah. The real cause? You know, every thousand years or so, it might not be just the Hermes. The nightmare blast night comes, etc., etc. Et you know, like blast you disturb yeah. the world's air. Right, Rita. I don't think anybody in this party has any idea what's going on. No, not even slightly. They're just bullshitting. <laughs> yeah, they're nodding their heads and like hoping that everyone else I think that understands means what's going on. Mm -hmm. is how much yeah. formula uses. Oh, even good point. Mm. Yes. Mm. That was what I was going to say, actually. Are well, we could advance the plot by going somewhere, to like maybe to someone's same. house. I don't know whose. <laughs> The I have this friend's name the is children of the full moon. Dirk. They're Dirk? <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, I don't understand. Dirk. That's the stupidest name I've ever heard. Dirk? Okay, so since we were using those Hermes Blastia, it was making more air come out or something, so the... So stop using the Hermes Blastia. Autophagos was woken up. That's what I was worried about. Yeah. So just go around and kill all the <coughs> vampire that are using the Hermes Blastia. Well, that's what they were doing. It. Okay. Yeah. It was Judas' mission. Couldn't be bad. Yeah, there was the a whole turn in Rita's personality last episode because she had the break of last year or something. Oh. That's what I always believed. <laughs> but I was wrong. My my so digital wife who husband or whatever. <laughs> what are you even talking about? <laughs> talking about her naming her last year. Yeah. yeah. That's impossible. We need blast Stop all the blast lives. Yes, we need the internal combustion engine for Barrier our everyday blast life. <laughs> <laughs> well, Let's now it's guns it's, while we're at it. It's a yeah, sad reality, right. but I couldn't take on a really tough monster if I didn't have this. Yeah. It's almost as if this is some sort of allegory. Yeah, yeah the uh, one of the most recent Tales game, Tales of Gilia, has like the most obvious oil metaphor ever. Lizomata? Like, it's oh yeah. Is this our day and next machina right here? What's that? Uh, no, that's it's a delicious. Uh, no, this is the Rizzo soup like our, recipe. Our, uh, <laughs> That is still undiscovered uh, bullshit, bullshit, bullshit <laughs> words. Oh my god. <laughs> Something that is still undiscovered theory. I should just have Jodie LaForge's face over her. <laughs> okay, so. <laughs> so is she trying to, like, dispute the laws of her dynamics here except for Blastia or something? I, I can't much. tell. I don't know. It always makes me kind of laugh and get a little 
upset whenever you see these games try to pull out words that are the real science or fake science and try to convince you that somebody knows magic is magic yeah Yeah. it's it's sort of like it's like guys don't don't yeah but they kind of set themselves up for this by making her a phd student is the closest thing to the Rizomata formula. Fucking academia. It's, it's right? one thing if you want to like try to have world building by trying to like somewhat explain the magic, that's fine. But when you're constantly making up new shit to cover the plot holes that came because you're making up shit, yep. that's when it just collapses and falls apart. Well, you yeah, know, we can cover up this plot For hole example, by just making some sort of a, a knot or something in here of logic. Yeah. So the force is within us all. I don't some really stronger it, than but... others. Okay, great. Episode 1. Middle Chlorians. <laughs> Fuck you, I'm out. I don't really get Done. it, but... <laughs> Done. Then it's still uh-huh. in peace, right? So by that logic, if we could control... Yeah, that was pretty air, great. We could prevent provoking the yes, we already covered this. If you prevent the air from happening, then the thing doesn't show up. So we're supposed to go look at <laughs> He's just like, yeah. Yeah, Carol of all people <laughs> hey, has that's... absolutely no idea what's going on now you're really right dreaming. now. I will figure out this formula. Carol's like, this is our guild's new job. For me. Yeah, you do that. You do that. Huh? Later, Raven, fuckers. Where you <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I gotta you go watch that. Mad Men. <coughs> See you later. You gotta go look at the the world, the ultimate goal Wait a minute. Research. Raven's all, this screw this, I'm out. Raven, to keep up Raven left yeah, her party he knows. forever. He knows how stupid it is, he just doesn't want to deal with it. <laughs> Saving the world. I'm too old for that. Go ahead and solve your anagrams and stuff like that. I'm in my 30s or something. Limit as you come to positive or negative infinity, whatever. Yeah. (laughs) Let's go ahead and find find a summation of some magic bullshit. (laughs) I wouldn't mind if this entire game just turned into a Yuri Judy buddy pop. That would be pretty great. Yeah. yeah. If Repeated only this was uh, FF13 too, and that was one of the alternate endings. Yeah, I just really wish that Judy was actually the other protagonist, because just. Yeah. <sighs> but how are we supposed to find Yeah, Stell's kind of just is? there. Yeah, I mean, Yuri and Judy like, play is, off each other pretty well. Rita is more else. involved in the right in like the plot than Estelle is. Pretty yeah. much. Cores are made from Apathea after all. So Flynn and Nam and their friends. Especially yeah. when this game is kind of a character study and Estelle is kind of a weak character. Kind of? <laughs> She's unfortunately the female lead in a Tales game. Yeah, exactly. Really and like, everyone else kind of managed to escape from their roles, but Estelle it's is still like just Estelle. I want to go back inside. <laughs> Kicking me out? Jeez. Save point. Uh,